All right, so let's work on my red convertible. The first thing I noticed about this song is this phrase right here. So this phrase comes back. It's a little different here, but it's almost like um, you've got this phrase, then an echo part. Okay. And even here, comes back. Um, here is a little different. And it even comes back here in your left hand and here in your right hand. Okay, so because that phrase comes back so much, we should learn it first. So your hand position, you got your pinky on the G above middle C, okay? Your fourth finger is going to be on F sharp. Your third finger is on E flat. So go ahead and just get comfortable with that hand position. You can pause the video and play around and improvise with that hand position. And when you come back, we'll um, work on this phrase. So it goes five on G, four on F sharp, five on G, one on C, three on E flat, four on F, natural, not F sharp, and then one on C. Okay, so a little faster with the steady beat. So pause the video and get really comfortable with that, okay? So the tempo is cruising along, it says. So I kind of, I think it's a pretty fast song. It's about a convertible, right? So I think it's about your goal. Okay, so now again, this line right here, same thing, we'll skip that. Right here, it's a little different. We've got G, F sharp, G, C, E flat, F, C. No, no, no. Sorry, I was looking at the second line. It goes G, F sharp, G, C, E flat, C, F. So again, slowly. G, F sharp, G, C, E flat, C, F. All right, and then the last line is again. Da, 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 da. Okay, and then um, let's just go with that. Let's look at our left hand on the first page here. So we've got kind of an echo, okay? So they overlap right here, right? So when you play the C of in my red convertible on the bowl, <laughs> you start to play the left hand part. So we're in C5 finger again, and it's just this bass C, so right below middle C, uh, the C, next C down. So we go C chord, C chord, 4 in C major, right, which is an F major chord, but inverted. So 1, 1, 4, 4, 1, 1, 4, 4, 1. Just practice that, get comfortable with it. Just basically switching between one and four. All right, so remember our common tone is C. Um, and we just move both of these fingers up a step using our one and two. Okay, now let's take a peek at this measure. This measure is a little different. All right, so we had to pick up our hand and move it. Prepare our left hand, it says, okay. So we're moving, what is that bottom note down there? Well, it's the space below the last line of the bass clef. So what's the bottom line of the bass clef? Grizzly bears don't fly airplanes, G. And the space below would be a step below G to F. Now this F, here's middle C, here's F. It's that F, okay? So, now we're going to build a chord with that F, F, A, C, okay? And now, um, we're going to, let's see, um, move up to F, B flat, D. So get nice and comfortable with that. So 
I said this song is in C major and we could assume that because of the key signature but also it's really not in C major it uses a, a blues scale which is making use of this F sharp and E flat right so <laughs> you could but you could think about like in F major this is the one chord and this is the four chord Great, so now I'm gonna go through hands together for this page. Sorry for all the clunking and clanking. Okay. Um, okay. Let's make sure. All right, so um, I'm gonna go through it in tempo so you can just kind of hear 